Now, here's meteorologist TJ Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 future cast. A few snow showers coming through right now may actually find some more around on Monday. Again, that'd be that busy time of year. Yeah, snow showers ex still extending from Willimantic all the way out into New Bedford. And a lot of this is very light. Might see a little bit heavier across Kent County there. And at the worst, a dusting, they're kind of moving in and out. Threat tracker for tonight, low chance of any severe weather. Sunday low, same for Monday. Yeah, we've got the chance for snow showers Monday, but I don't think we're looking at anything serious there. Live pictures from downtown Providence. We are looking at dry conditions. Temperature of 33, wind busy from the northwest, nine miles an hour. Pictures from Newport, and we've got dry conditions here as well. 34, busy wind there, wind from the west, 15 miles an hour. 30 degrees currently in Smithfield. Let's get a look at temperatures uh, elsewhere over in New Bedford, 32, Taunton at 30 degrees. Now, satellite radar picture showing a little smattering of snow showers here in the northeast. We do have a front coming on through. That front pushes offshore over the next few hours, and behind it, we'll see the winds shift into the northwest and drier air will work its way in. Until then, though, we are dealing with some snow showers. Then we'll see some snow showers for the next few hours. And they're gone by tomorrow morning, waking up to sunshine once again, 8 o'clock in the morning, looking dry. I think we're staying dry through the daytime tomorrow. Now, here we are Sunday evening at 7 o'clock. Notice lots of clouds arriving once again. We're going to have some milder air making a push into the northeast. The end result, extra clouds and maybe a few snow showers on Sunday night, late in the night, and into Monday morning. Notice a few snow showers here and there. I'm not really anticipating anything terribly widespread. Still could be a couple of snow showers around uh, on Monday evening, but this is not going to be a big storm system at all. Forecast for Sunday morning. Now we are looking at increasing amounts of sunshine. Could be a few clouds around first thing in the morning, but notice the temperature starting out cold in the teens, getting into the upper 20s by around noontime. Let's pinpoint the afternoon for you. Over in Westerly, about 33. Now we're against at 33 at the freezing mark in Newport. Sunny and dry and cold in central and northern Rhode Island. 30 Coventry, 30 situate, West Warwick, Warwick, Cranston into Providence and East Providence, about 30. Southeastern Mass, lower 30s from Attleboro all the way out into New Bedford. Here's that live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven day future cast. Now on Monday, we do have the chance for a couple of snow showers, especially in the morning hours. Temperatures getting pretty mild. Look at that, 41 degrees in the uh, early afternoon. Tuesday, even milder. We're looking at sunshine on this day with temperatures uh, in the mid to upper 40s, blend of sunshine and clouds on Tuesday. On Wednesday, looking at lots of sun, a little bit cooler, about 40 degrees. Thursday, a little bit cooler still, about 36. Looks like we could have some rain showers around on Friday. Looks like they should be out of here for Saturday with temperatures in the lower 40s. So no real extreme cold over the next seven days. Be sure to download our WPRI Pinpoint Weather app. You can get live interactive radar and weather wherever you are for your iPhone, iPad and Android devices. You can track these little snow showers that we have out there on your phone or tablet. I think Tony's still at the mall trying to wrap a gift. Probably. I yeah. would be too. All right. I'm not very good at it. <laughs> it's an art. Coming up in sports tonight. URI.